Well, firefighters there are getting some ground on the park fire with containment bumping up to about 14%. Just minutes ago, Cal Fire updating its numbers. The park fire has scorched more than 383,000 acres since it sparked last Wednesday near Chico. CBS 13's Rachel Wolf is back on the fire lines in Butte County as the blaze continues to climb on California's list of largest wildfires in history. Good morning, Rachel. Good morning. So now that it's nearly 384,000 acres, it is now in the top five. It is number five in the state's history of largest wildfires bypassing the Creek Fire. Uh, so again, this is not necessarily a chart topper that we want because this fire is continuing to burn. But let me say this. Uh, we have gone up Highway 32. It is burning this way. So that is east. This is west towards Chico behind me, and we did move so you can get a better shot of some of the smoke as you see that's settling in this canyon. Big Chico Creek is at the bottom of this canyon, and this is where the firefight was last week, but at least it's a better visual. We're up a little higher than where they were firefighting. No firefighters in this area, but we do know that there are thousands of firefighters that have been working on this fire, and it's been something that's been keeping them busy for days. The Butte County, um, Butte County firefighters have been helping along with Cal Fire as they battled this blaze. More than 384,000 acres have burned. Again, it's the fifth largest in the state's history and the largest fire currently burning in the United States. Firefighters being urged to stay aggressive with more than 5,500 crews working to put out hot spots. It's been primed to go. Uh over the last number of years. Obviously with the temperatures and the winds, everything's just kind of aligned perfectly for this fire to be burning four to 5,000 uh, acres an hour. So again, it's burned like the size of Los Angeles is basically how far and wide this reaches. 165 structures have been destroyed, 16 have been damaged, and there will be more for sure um, because they have those inspection teams that are out and about. It's actually a beautiful morning here in Butte County where we are. Uh, we just actually drove up as far as we could before we could do this live shot and shot the latest image of the plume. But it is, I mean, probably Lake Almanor would be a, an idea of where that would be. So again, not affecting the Chico area at all, but about an hour, 45 minutes to an hour away east as the crow flies. Mm. All right, Rachel Wolf, Live Forest in Butte County this morning. Thank you, Rachel.